TIFU by turning my family into a Victorian era sitcom. Like most good TIFUs this one unfolded over time. For context my extended family are slightly snobby English academics. However I am a down-to-earth Canadian. A couple years back, while at home one day, taking a prod at our family heritage and because I thought it would be funny, I referred to my only child using an overly formal Victorian style. Hey daughter, I said pausing to see if I could get her attention and amusement. At nine years old she was already pretty sharp and after a pause and with a sly smirk responded, yes. Father? Quote, I must admit, I flinched on the inside. Now of course I couldn't just leave it at that. I started referring to her as daughter regularly. Daughter. Could you put out the garbage? Quote, daughter. What would you like for dinner? Quote, yet the apple doesn't fall far from the tree and she not only doubled down on calling me father, but started calling her mother, mother, as well. Her mother hates it. It dawned on me a couple months ago that we no longer use any casual family names at all. To my amusement, and low-key horror, the Victorian style has stuck and we now refer to each other in the way any standard Victorian family would without even thinking about it. While it's fun to be unique, it also makes us the exact thing I was mocking. To anyone outside the immediate family, we probably sound unbearable. I guess I should be a little more careful about who I mock in the future. Yours sincerely, Father. T.L. D.R. Called my daughter, daughter, I'm now stuck for like being called, father, forever. Very good. One is amused. You need to start calling your parents mater and pater like in an Oscar Wilde play. You are my clone, apparently. Other than a couple of years behind. I'm Canadian with slightly stuffy English relatives. A couple of years ago I referred to my daughter as daughter. She now regularly calls me father. Unless she's upset, then I'm dad, daddy still. My son has picked up the habit. And my wife hates being called mother. But there's no way to undo it. We are what we pretend to be, so we must be careful about what we pretend to be. Kurt Vonnegut Better than daddy in the current messed up state of popular English language. My three children are all adults and long since moved out. This is how I am going to refer to them from now on. Do you address your wife as mother, Mr. Pence? I would recommend Jeeves and Wooster, but it does not appear to be streaming right now. Might be available in Canada on Amazon Prime. It would really cement the old British. It takes place in George V. But close enough. A very wholesome Tifu. Love it. Edit. My 17 yo son greets me many mornings with mother. And a nod. In passing to the shower in the morning. And I in return greet him as son. I never realized it was a Victorian thing. But I just thought it was cute. I am American. BTW. But I really think Ema gonna lean into this now. We have older children. Some out of the house. And younger children. Youngest being eight. I'm confident she'll run with it in a heartbeat. We also have a two-yo grandson who lives with us but I think I'll let that one alone for now. Husband could have some potential. As well. I don't mind being called mother. It's kinda cute. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Heracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.